So we actually met at church a long, long time ago. Uh, she was only a student at the time, and I was a teacher. I was a student, I was a troublemaker. He came in and kind of schooled me. I like to see him try. She was like my most difficult student. Like, you know, she didn't really um, agree with anything I was teaching. And, you know, we just kind of kept in touch. You know, I just wanted to kind of be there as a, as a friend. My cousin had just graduated high school and he had invited him to his graduation dinner and so we all went. So I was sitting with her cousin and then she was sitting across from me with her family but the entire time during lunch, I kept looking over at her. And he saw me at the table, and then I was trying to avoid eye contact with him because I noticed he was just staring at me, so I felt a little embarrassed. And I kept smiling, and then she kept looking back, and she kept smiling too. She was like nervous. I just, I just couldn't really keep my eyes off her. And then after we finished lunch, I immediately asked her, hey, do you have to go anywhere right now? Do you want to go get some boba real quick with me? Yeah, everybody else declined, but I accepted, so we went and got some boba. And then we just walked over to Tasty, and then we, you know, went on that first date, you know, and then that's when it kind of trickled out into everything else. There was a period in my life where I fell into deep depression. I never thought I could be happy again. But again, you've proven me wrong. If God is real, then I can feel His presence through you, full of unconditional love, fun, and warmth. I actually want to share a couple of experiences that I've had with you and hope you can see how I see you. Every day, you take our dogs out for a walk, morning and nights, and sometimes afternoon. You always make sure to brush their teeth and clean their eye boogers daily. You're often the only one cleaning up all of their poop in the backyard. Unlike me, you also make sure to treat them with real meats and organ meats so that they too can have a healthy and fulfilling diet and lifestyle. Our boys, our boys are so blessed to have you as their human.